I'm taking a dookie. And I'm the guy who made edamame. Yeah. It's B-Log time. All Ego Ethan Page is a world traveled wrestler from Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. He's a crazy toy enthusiast and massive collector. Ethan used to have a dad bond, but recently fell in love with fitness while still managing to eat his favorite foods during his epic cheat day. Enjoy his weekly vlog where he gives you a backstage behind the scenes look at his crazy job and life. Good morning, Columbia, South Carolina. Oh, let's fix that there. There you go. Although I do have a new haircut. My aunt did it. That's right. I'm a Michigan guy now. Family's hooking it up. Thanks to my Aunt Donna in Canton, Michigan. I will put her uh, salon information here because now she cuts famous people's hair. Even though she pretty much had a heart attack because she's like, Oh my God, you're going to have this hair on TNT and TBS. It needs to be nice. Well, it's very nice. So thank you to my aunt for hooking it up. Here we are for Dynamite and Rampage. But also the usual shenanigans. Today... I'll be going to the gym and a toy store with 10. I have to make sure we get these weekly toy hunts. So this one is going to be a solo with 10 and I can't wait for people to see it. If you want to see it early, you can. You guys know the deal. Go to patreon.com slash Ethan Page. Sign up. Enjoy early access to vlogs and toy hunts. And all the photos that we take are all put up there. I'm also working on a very secretive project right now that only my Patreons know about, who have also been keeping it a very, very tight lip secret. So thank you to my Patreons. I love, I love that I can trust you. I appreciate it very much. I wanted to give a special thanks to everyone who's been ordering the Vlog and Egon t-shirts available on playbyjulian.com. You guys are the coolest. Patreons also get a discount on that website too, so it's worth it. Sign up to Patreon. Check it out. And I took Billy Gunn's pre-workout and my heart is racing. I need to go work out. <laughs> Gunpowder, baby. Oh my God, my heart is, I'm like talking too much. I feel like I'm not gonna stop. Uh, yeah, so good to know there's some stimulant in this Billy gun, and it's gonna give me a great workout. We're doing chest, which means you're gonna see these tight titties out. Pumped, pumped. Even more pumped for this toy hunt. All right, here we go. Dynamite, here we come, but first, first. Stopping at the gym. Dumbass town. Let's go. Wow! Ah! Like, subscribe, and comment. Forgot to. That's, that was very important. Like, subscribe, and comment. Okay, here we go. I see a man okay. in the mirror. Okay. We're going to the gym. I know I already high fived the camera. But this. Douche, look at this car. Street, hits like every hour. If you want some beer, yeah, 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 they rolled this around, I said, I'll take I'm it. The man in the I'm here for long, I claim my residence. I'm the man in the mirror. My number's growing, ain't it evident? I'm the man in the mirror. All right, what are we doing today? Titties. 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 Right, uh, baby got all the labels <laughs> like tweaking now, yeah. I just said it's standard day I have to allow. Yeah, I'm sure I got some years left. Watch me key to my sound. I'm gonna deem myself the man of the year. You should've never showed this music to some dogs. Cause we switch it up and now we on the fours. Baby always making gas, he found a sauce. Come and find me flowing 90 in a foreign whip with the roof that's disappearing. Yes, I'm reflecting. Can't take things for granted while I'm staring. Yes, I'm reflecting. See a man in the mirror that I'm proud of. In way too deep on my mama, I need power. Babies on the street, I may hit like every hour. If you want some beef. Brutal. So, we're only doing four exercises. Six sets of each. We started at five and went to 30, changing five pounds. Now we went from 30 down to five. This dumbass is still doing 90 pounds at 25 reps. I am definitely not doing that. 
He's a maniac. I'm the man in the mood. Ricky Stark showed up at the gym. I'm the man in the mood. Ricky Superstar Stark. Look at this mother. I'm the man in the mood. <laughs> <laughs> what did you start off for the five reps? 90? No, you did not. Yeah, I did. Oh, did you? Did it. Either 80 or 90. Okay. I just want to, you know, I, I ended with 70s. For the 30 reps, so. Good for you. Your fingers for sure covered up. Two bags, one day, big balls, pop off, no pills, blue bills, cha cha, real smooth. Two cars, two rings, new hounds, move quick, move slick, bitch bag, I took her. Now you mad. That was insane. Now you mad, bitch. Oh, whatever. No, I stop. Think, I don't really think it's that cool. Bitch. That was cool. If I did a one arm, it'd be sick. Now I would have shit my bitch. pants trying to do that. <laughs> Wait, Wait, you saw that? Oh, yeah. That was sick. Now you mad, bitch. 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 Now you RPG the car. Boom. Bitch, I'm walking home. It's far. Why'd I do that? I'll... You're like the Iron Sheik, dude. <laughs> Flame suit, French letter, and my girl bad. Gatekeeper says open, I ain't coming back. 15 minute TED talk, collecting 40 rags. One milli paid in tax, bitch, do the math. That song you just heard, Mathematics, out April 8th. You thought I was going to show you an upskirt, but yeah. What's up, my egomaniacs? It's Baby No Money. Also, you know, I'm up, I'm up, yeah, I changed my eating I'm taking it, dude. And I'm the guy who made out of mommy. Hey, guys, make sure you eat your vegetables. Up, Max, but also he doesn't work here, so I get it. Hello, RJ. Hey, look at us. Hold on, let's get a different background. Is it? Oh, you want to show people in? Is this the point of this? Yeah, okay. because we work together. Look at us. I'm surprised it doesn't say, uh, I don't know, Alpha One. Did uh, you guys ever have a truck? No. Oh, that's it. Actually, yeah, we had a ring truck once. I owned it. And then you sold it? And then I sold it. To another indie promotion? Yes, but like, very far away. Did you, you had your own ring? Yes, yeah, sold that too. Yeah. Yeah. There was a ring on an episode of SCTV. Uh, John Candy is Ju uh, Julia Child. And he's boxing Mr. Rogers, played by Mark Short. I swear it's a Toronto ring. I think it's that old, old Max ring. Max ring? The stiffest yeah. ring of all time? Yes, which is like, the Andre the Giant is in this ring. I'm like, yeah, I'm sure this is it. No way, because that was a 16 by 16 ring. It would have looked like uh, yeah, back a the, crib. You never saw those old indie shows that people used to do. No footage. I don't but watch wrestling. Unfortunately, do you want? Do you remember the first time we wrestled? Me and you? Yeah. Ever? Yeah. No. Uh, hand of the day. That was not the first time we wrestled. What? No. Uh, I want to say I wrestled you when you were a wild <laughs> stallion. Oh my god, maybe. Maybe it's unconfirmed. <laughs> Finally, you it's were confirmed. so you were so sure. Anyways, uh, I, was, okay. I literally just wanted to be like, "Hey, how cool is it that we yeah, we were want to have here? a moment and it's not turned into a moment." Go ahead. I have problems with you uh, on your vlog. 
I have vlog heat with you. Why? Because the last time I was on this vlog, yeah, we uh, something happened between us. We had a falling out on Twitter. We unfollowed each other. We <laughs> talked about it. We we made amends. We talked about it on the vlog, and I thought it was a great moment, and I was like, that's kind of great. And then you completely cut it out of your vlog. It's me complaining about your brother singing O Canada or something. <laughs> Hold on! Was, you know what? I think I have, if I have the clip. Through the archives? Yep, I, okay. if I have, this, this, this is a, a big company now, this vlog. Yeah, yeah I so know. I have four hard drives now, the library. Oh my God. Yes, if I can find it, I will put it in. So, I, by the way, we should talk. I said something. What do you mean? Uh, is this your thing? Yeah. I said something on the thing. I like it. You, what did you say? Well, are you getting closer? I can get as close as you want. So we've known each other for a number of years. Yeah. And we've been following each other on Twitter. We've been following each other. Yeah. And then, you know, sometimes some people get to test those muscles. Yeah, me. Yeah. My brother. I'm muted. Yeah, yeah. Respectful. Yeah, yeah. Tasteful. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so then uh, you somebody replied to something that you were on to me and I so clicked on the original tweet. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Only to discover that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, because I once tweeted at him and he just ignored it. So I just go, oh, he either muted me or unfollowed me because I muted. So I was like, well, I'm gonna unfollow you. I can't have this guy unfollow me or follow all this shit. So and then like three weeks later, you booked me for the show. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, oh okay. And now we've been yeah. 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 Why? I was just interesting. Two thousand nineteen. That's what this is. Just, uh, just any. Don't say that. It does. It does. No, but like this could be eighteen fifteen, and we'd still be. So I did a show in West Virginia. Yes. North Carolina. Okay. And this guy, whole drive. Yeah. So talking about how people are like, oh, you know, you don't follow me back. He's pretty much like dogging people for not following, for him not following them back. Like he's like bigging he guilt follows you. So he's like complaining about all these people. Then drops me off at the airport, and as I'm walking out of the room, he goes, hey, make sure you follow me back, bro. I was, I was ready to. Sometimes they'll be like, oh, let me let me make sure I can find some Many a DJ, morning radio DJ. So, yeah, give me your book. Oh, this is mine. I'm like, boom. I'm like, thanks. And as I'm talking to him, I hit the mute. Like, <laughs> like, oh my God. Or you just hit the unfollow? Yeah, but I, I want them to see the little thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, my question is will we wait and in a stalemate to see who follows each other first? I think we should perhaps. So I grab the voice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah. and subscribe. And see yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll go like, oh. If it gets 100 will likes. Will we follow each other? If we get past the YouTube monetization threshold, maybe we will we follow have. each other. We have officially. I make 10 cents a video now. Oh, yeah. See, now I feel like to help you get to the money level, it's like good and like you're there. And I'm like, I feel like I'm giving you money. I hit the nice line of your brother. That was a like good line. You know, I'm, I'm a union actor. I don't feel like you're getting all of I'll follow you. <laughs> I'm good where I'm at. Because <laughs> I was happy. I was like, that's a great moment. So what happens is, yeah. but if I ever think like, nah, maybe I don't want to share that with everybody. Right. It gets cut. Sure. And then I hope this never happens, but it did happen. Really that, no, yeah, I know. And I will hold on to it. There's so many people here have been holding on to years. I'm like, come on the show. Come sit with me. Let's talk about it. And Let's it's, talk about it. Sounds, it sounds like this biggest heat. And then this this is the biggest heat we had. Is yeah. like, you unfollowed me. You unfollowed me. It's like, oh, I'm following you now. Yeah, that's true. We followed each other. Yeah. Anyways. Okay, like, so, okay, yeah, here's, okay. Another, here's another little tidbit. So, yeah. with Alpha One. My wife, big fan of RJ City. Okay, all these on. fans, nobody. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And I'm gonna be blunt and honest about this. Yes. So I pride myself on my booking ability. Okay. With how I would run the company, whatever, <laughs> blah blah. Yes. And my wife is like, why? Why? Why is RJ only come every once in a while? Yeah. And I had to look my wife in the eye and tell her, because I'm on the show and yep. we have very similar presentation and shtick. I go, if I book him, I'm kind of shooting myself in the foot. Yeah. Yeah. So I had to tell you that. I completely understand, like, no heat. Yeah. I'm not, like, 
what? Yeah. I'm like, no, I get it. Like, you have, unless, like, I could see if you were in a certain feud or doing yes, something yes, different. Yes. Right? Or maybe when you started to detect yes, or whatever. Yes. And I think I also got into a stage where I got into just conceptual wrestling. Yes. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> Playing with the existential quality of what it means to be a wrestler. So, no. anyways, go check out Babyface. Yeah, check face. out my stuff. Go check out Babyface. Would you like? Uh, did you finally go? Thank God, I'm not doing this. <laughs> I I thought it was really funny, dude. Thank you. And do you have more in the you can? Say, uh, can I say something sweet, or you're gonna cut it out? No, you can say something. When sweet. When I first did my uh, special for somewhere else. A year ago, yes. uh, you texted me after, and it was very sweet, and I appreciate it, because we're not friends, in the sense that we don't socialize out of work, we don't go bowling, we don't come to mini golf, right? right. Although, where did we go once? What do you mean, where did we go where did, where did we socialize outside of wrestling once? Do you have any idea? Cirque de Soleil! Yes! Did you ever talk to that girl again? Uh, the balance woman. <laughs> yeah, she's good. Oh, so you can put all these things, which balance them, that was a fun time. <laughs> Say hey, how to your wife. Congrats. Fist bump. Ah, oh, you suck. You ruined everything. All right. I realized that was the worst. 10 eating video of all time. So I'm gonna make it up to you guys. Next week will be the best because you're gonna be in it. My dad actually gave me this idea. I'm gonna do a contest. Send me a video of you eating in slow motion and I will edit together a package for next week. Maybe I'll throw in a couple people eating throughout the vlog since I can only use the song for 30 seconds. <laughs> if you wanna enter, all you have to do is film yourself eating in the same way as Ten does and send it to Ethan Page at live.ca. That's right, I moved to America, but my email is still Canadian. And if you don't have a way of sending videos that are large files, go to wetransfer.com, use that, send it to me, and I'll download them all and use them. And I'm gonna let Ten watch them. You'll get his reaction and he'll choose the winner on the following week. And you can pick any item you want on playedbyjulian.com. So go check out the merch on the site and prepare yourself to potentially be the number one eater. Are you a perfect 10? Let's find out. Send me videos of you eating. This is a real thing. I know I'm gonna regret this. Back to the vlog. And not do your pose. <laughs> All right, this? is definitely the most impressive, star-studded, oh, yes. and magnificent, magnificent photo shoot we've ever done. Thank you, Paige. Thank you. Thank you, I agree. We have the great Paige Van Zandt in here. So there's only one thing left to say, right? That's it. Mr. Ethan Page, hit that music. Singing low, wall up, pop a ball off of your chain swinging, clang, clang, and it costs a lot. Bitch, I'm always at the gola, yeah, and you are not bad as beat. Keep on going till you hit the spot. Whoa, I'm a big bag hunter with the bow. She got a big bag, never drop a low. Mama called me and she happy with the girl. Never ever yeah. fall for a party that's a no. Welcome back to Rampage, where right now we have Dan Lambert, Ethan Page, Page Van Zandt, and the TNT champion, Scorpio Sky, standing I'm by. I'm gonna admit, I felt a little like a bride at the altar when a certain couple disappeared last month and left me behind with all these great stripper jokes and no one to use them on. But I'm gonna take the high road when it comes to Ty and Sammy from this point forward, because A, the legacy of the TNT and co-TNT titles has been disrespected enough already, and B, they don't need my help embarrassing themselves with this ridiculous high school king and queen of the prom gimmick they got going on right now. Hey, and in case you don't know what Dan the man here is talking about, these two clowns took naked photos with the prestigious TNT title. Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs>
Despicable. And that's not even the worst, but my question really is, is who was behind the camera? Was it Fuego Del Sol doing all the heavy lifting that Sammy's not built up enough for? Come on, Ethan. <laughs> no, 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 no. Maybe it was that Orange Cassidy guy taking his freshly squeezed nickname a little too seriously. Oh, oh, stop. Hold on, hold on. Wait, are you saying that's how he hurt his shoulder? <laughs> enough, enough. We are not sinking to their level. They are never getting this match, and this interview is over. Hey, hey, Dan. Is that, is that Dan, baby. So you're not gonna give us the match, is that right? Not gonna give us the match? What part of never do well, these morons you, not understand? You, do you like your car? Consider this, consider this step one of trying to change your mind. What is he doing? Let's do it, Ty. That's my car! Whoa, whoa, That's whoa, 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 whoa! What is that? You step! Oh, come on! That's oh, wow. Get it. Ty oh, Conti and Sammy Kavara! Wrecking Dan Lambert's car. Smashing that car! Oh my, how much is that car worth? It's South Carolina! It's a BMW! Worth a lot! Destroying it! Ty, give me a spray paint. Oh man. Look at this. Destroying this innocent car. They've never seen a BMW. No match. No match. They don't even know what. No match. Be mad, he writes. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Nah, nah, nah. one more, one more. Wow. Jeez. Oh, so much for that X5. Be mad. I'd be furious. Car's worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. Sammy Guevara and Ty Conti leaving Dan Lambert with a reminder of what happens when you cross him. But All right, here we are for the end of the vlog, but something very, very special. I've, I've held one in my hand on my Toy Hio vlog, but I actually officially have both of my Cella figures. I haven't opened these yet, so I haven't actually played with one, felt one in my hand. Uh, so this will be the actual first time I've yet to do this yet. So I figured, you know, Ethan the Toy Hunter, t-shirt available on playedbyjulian.com, new toy hunts every single Sunday on this channel, subscribe. I wanted to get this on video, and I thought since the weekly Wednesday vlog captures my career, and this would be a great thing to do. So I'm gonna open these for you guys, the vlog viewers, the egomaniacs, the fans. This was an interesting vlog um, before I get to the toys. We had baby no money send some clips. Uh, he has become one of my favorite artists uh, in the last year. Not just Edamame, even though it's the most addicting song known to man right now. The whole Eat Your Veggies album, anything he does with Young Gravy is hilarious and great. And the new song, which might be the first time people have heard it ever public and it was on the vlog. So very cool. His song comes out on the 8th. Check it out on iTunes. Apple Music, uh, what's the other one? Spotify, that's, anyways. Go get his album, download it, it's awesome. New song out, April 8th. Let's open these damn toys. I love it. Finally gonna actually see what it's like. In my not even close to being finished office, I threw this together for you guys. I, there's this certain standard that you guys expect Ethan Page's office slash man cave slash toy room to be. This isn't it, but it's something. It's a start, okay? Oh my God. Oh, this is so cool. I will 100% be doing figure photography with these. Yo, this is awesome. I love it. Got the gear on the back. Old school indie Ethan Page. I've actually worn this gear on pay-per-view as well in an Ultimate X match. So that's cool. Now it's here forever. This is awesome. Here we go, the variant. I know people don't have this one yet. So at least I've got this first. 
It's crazy how many people had their cello figure before me. Now I have boxes full. The process to get these done took so long. I, this variant is epic. I love it. Wow, this is incredible. You got Big Boy Bomb here, the name before the Ego's Edge. But this is Big Boy Bomb, that's such a throwback to the vlog, traveling in the Indies. This is unreal. So listen, I gotta say thanks to Chella for making this happen. All these things that I signed on for before signing with All Elite Wrestling. So for them to see value in me before I ended up on national television for the best wrestling company in the world, it means a lot that they would have taken a risk to make toys of All Ego Ethan Page uh, from the independents. So I'm glad they sold out so quick and it was a big hit for you guys. Timing wise, probably great. I'm very happy I got to get these in before, um, you know, became one half of the men of the year. These are very cool. It's insane to me that there's any form of action figure of me. Uh, fingers crossed that we eventually get a Jazz Wars figure, but if not, this is a career highlight. Thanks to Chella. I will be auctioning off autographed, custom autographed Ethan Page Cello figures at the end of April. Here's the information. Go download Whatnot. It's an app, it's a live auction app, and I will be auctioning these bad boys off live. I have signed a long-term agreement with Whatnot. I will be streaming live on their app once a month. So that's very cool. So if you wanna get your hands on these, more specifically, you wanna get your hand on this variant, Signed by All Ego. Do it up. Download the app. Use the link in the description. This is sick. I effing love these. I love this week's vlog. Although chaotic and insane and way different, very happy that we got to do it. If you want to see the early toy hunt from this weekend from Orlando, go to patreon.com slash the page right now because it's available already. People have already been watching it. And if you don't want to do live auction, guess what? You can come meet me live. Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, April 19th at d &E Collectibles. I'll be doing a meet and greet the night before Dynamite in Pittsburgh. That's coming up very soon. And then June 18th, one of my most popular vlogs, Toy Hi-O. I'll be returning to Toy Hi-O for the second time. Oh, just dropped myself there. I'll be vlogging, I'll be meeting, I'll be selling and signing. I'll have t-shirts, probably these. Whew. All right, we got some big stuff in the works, guys. Very big stuff. And I cannot wait for you guys to find out about it, hear about it, see it, and most importantly, support it. Thanks to the Egomaniacs for every single week. Um, watching these, watching the toy hunt, subscribing to Patreon, to this channel, liking, commenting, every little bit helps. We're growing and growing and growing. Kind of like these guns. Love you guys. See you on Sunday. I'll see you next Wednesday. Bye.